They come from the world's biggest electronics companies. This is an unbelievable opportunity. This process is not about a job. It's about making sure my house is spotless. At stake, a chance to change the way we clean and become the vacuum apprentice. In most areas of our lives, technology's changed the way that we do things over the years. But when it comes to cleaning, it's remained a pretty manual process. Yet the last 12 months has seen the release of several updated and more versatile robotic vacuum cleaners. These devices use onboard cameras to photograph and map your home, even containing sensors to stop them falling downstairs or repeatedly hitting the cat. Plus, they have a choice of cleaning options, with some allowing you to select areas to be avoided. It's all very well that these devices look more exciting than your average cleaning equipment, but the question is, how well do they actually do the job? So we devised a little experiment, which may not be the most scientific, but should give us a little indication of whether these bots are up to the challenge. Clean floor? Meet some talcum powder. On cleaning the talc, my traditional vacuum, which cost around a third of the price, did pretty well, only leaving a slight residue. So, here goes. Probably the most high profile of our apprentices is the Roomba, the self-styled original bot on the block. It works similarly to many of its young pretenders, such as the Samsung Navabot, also boasting a timer function, handy for when you want to program a clean while you're at work. LG is fighting its corners hard with the squarer designed Hombot with corner busting brushes to boot. All the machines we tested proved fairly good on superficial crumbs, but weren't big on cleaning up the talc. And whilst they may have struggled on our rug, they had greater success on lower pile carpet. Which leaves us with a bit of a grubby room to clean. Luckily, another robot is on hand to help. The iRobot Brava sweeps and mops. Handy in this instance, and I'm relieved to say the tiles are regaining their usual appearance. But the floor isn't the only place that these machines are trying to clean up. Wouldn't it be nice if you could clean the windows without working up a sweat? Mm. Well, this hopes to be the answer, the Winbot. It certainly washes the windows nicely and works on any thickness of glass, but the permanent power cord attached does make it feel a bit low tech. Whilst the future may hold the promise of great things, these candidates may not be ready to take over all your cleaning duties just yet. You are fired.